and a warm welcome to the Mike Downs page with a new logo. We'll talk about that in the next video. Moving along, this session is about Gmail and working faster. So new Gmail, in my view, loads between 15 and 20 seconds. Uh, classic Gmail is disappearing off the face of the earth. However, there is a fix if you want it fast in the basic HTML view which does load fast, 1.4 seconds on my machine. So what's this all about really? In my main account, if I click the cog, there is no back to classic now. I have to use the new Gmail. In this center screen, if you are in the old classic, there was a button that said try the new Gmail. On the right hand side, in one of my accounts a couple of days ago, there was a button to say go back to the classic. That seems to be disappearing and I will tell you exactly what's happening today. Once again, one of my other accounts, my media account, I've lost the ability to go back to classic and one of my G Suite ones, which is the Watson Kenilworth one, still has the go back to classic. The reason I mention this is because if we're talking about Gmail essentially being write a message, read a message over a long distance, electronic internet distance, then if you have a load time which is quicker, you can see your messages when you're in a crisis or in a hurry. Usually, most times, you will see mail.google as the new one. The basic HTML is a little bit longer and it's got forward slash mail and it has this uh, UOH just as, as an identifier if you into these sorts of things. We are going to demo in a couple of seconds the switch to standard view or set basics HTML, which is quite a classic... Um, you want to say classic, I mean a real retro look to it really. So in this example, and this is one of the reasons I've made this video, is here is my own private Gmail. And what I did here is I got a National Geographic, which was live. It was Safari. So I clicked on it. Literally where, where the laser pointer is, I clicked on it. And that loading um, thing at the top there literally lasted forever. Obviously the, um, the code had crashed. I would never ever get there. So what I did quickly is refresh the thing. But this time load into basic HTML and boom, it loaded up really, really fast. And I will tell you the difference uh, and how you actually get to that. So that was one of the, the problems. Oh, there we go. There's another uh, slide there, which means I can successfully go to the demo. So if you want to work fast, uh, let's refresh this and I'll show you what I mean. So when we refresh it and I want to switch to standard at the moment, so this is my sort of test account if you like. So this is where I would have started the stopwatch and we could be running up to about 15, 18, 20 seconds. So although it's actually kind of there, if you notice down the bottom left hand side, there is uh, no gadgets that are still loading. So anyway, it's there. So if you wanted to say, unfortunately get a crash, the way you'd actually get it is to watch bottom right down here in a second. So three, two, one, click. And then when it starts to load, load basic HTML bottom right. It's got a little blue link to it. And what happens is that instantly loads just like that. There's nothing on the screen that's that's sort of, sort of private, really. So uh, stop the video and watch. But I don't think you're going to learn anything off me privately. Then at the top, you've got this idea. Again, this is the bit where, in my opinion, if you want to message fast and you have to be on desktop, then you really need to uh, be in a position to know that this basic version exists because it helps you out. And then at the very, very top, you are currently viewing Gmail in HTML, which is standard, of course, which is the new, new Gmail. But you can set basic HTML as a default, which is really interesting because you get this um, quite a, in my mind, super retro, you know, <laughs> I was going to say 20 year old look to it nothing to click down on the left hand side there's loads in blue to click on the right so if i went to refresh this whole page you watch you blink and you'll miss this ready click boom that is a quick load isn't it that is a really quick load and if you wanted to go back as a oh this is interesting standard view top right can you see it next to the email address standard view one two three four five six OK, seven, eight, and it's still waiting for the gadgets to come in. That's all I've got to say about this. If you wanted to go to the help page, it's CGmail in standard or basic HTML. 
uh, basic, by the way, HTML is absolutely vital. If you're in a coffee shop or in a position railway station, who, who knows where you might be, which has got a real slow um, internet connection coming in. It could even be in an office, let's be honest. And you're loading all of this code for this new, it takes a lot of time. Little note that if you are using basic HTML, then you will not get a chat spell checker, keyboard shortcut. And, and at the end of the day, Gmail is about, or any email, is about a communication idea, and that is send and get it instantly. So if I go back, last thing, to repeat, load basic, click, one, two, three, and it's there, look. So in my mind, you can actually see that vital message that you've got to read before your meeting or your lesson at school or um, your seminar at university or whatever. Once again, this has been the Mike Downs page. And I think on this next video, where's, it, where's this little thing gone? Where's the little one gone? Oh, yeah, it's this one down here. Look, so I could show you if you like. This is, you know, this video is in over. But if you wanted to go along there, I made a little gif going around of the new logo, the wheel of learning, if you like.